When you find the net consistently, that brings with it attention. Can he continue along the Europa League goals trail? We're about to find out. And a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. I'm Derek Ray, joined for commentary by former England international Lee Dixon, and thoroughly looking forward to bringing you round of 32 second leg action tonight in the Europa League. It's Bournemouth up against Lazio. Well, Derek, with that heavy defeat away from home in the first leg, you have to think what mood are the hosts in tonight? Surely they need an early goal and put the pressure on. Thank you. Enjoy the game. And now this Europa League round of 32, second leg, begins. And this is how the hosts will begin the game today. What do you think about this particular setup? Well, strikers like support, and they've got support today in the number 10. We've also got three midfield players behind, two slightly wide, and one just sitting in front of the back four. And this is the initial 11 for the visitors today. Wing backs are important in this setup. Did you enjoy your experience of playing at wing back, Lee? Not at all under Bruce Rock. It's a very, very demanding role, as we can see. The full backs are exposed both offensively and defensively. Lots of support inside them, but going forward, they need to try and get the ball into the box for the two up front. Over it comes. Clattered away. They're succeeding in finding forward gears, but will they produce from this position? Let's see. Clattered away. Parolo. Tony Vilhena with it. Drama. Effective challenge. Jackson Irvin. And here now is Lewis Cook. And Adam Smith on the ball. William. And here now is Diego Costa. Now Dendonka. Kramer. Vilhena. And showing fine vision. And Joaquin Correa. And the keeper had to... And it might be... Betwixt and between that clearance. Well, I can't believe it's still level. What a save that was from the keeper. Diego Costa. It's a very neatly cons now William coming into it. William! And it is the opening goal of the contest. Well, it was always going to be a tight game, but now all of a sudden one team ahead. Things have got to change on both sides. Well, you tell youngsters in that position just to hit the target. You can't score unless you do. And on this occasion he does and he scores. Well, let's go back to the goal that was scored. So the aggregate advantage, 3-1. Parolo, and now Sergi Enrich. The ball with Luis Alberto. Tony Vilhena with it. Luis Alberto. Now, what can he do here? Real chance. Priority was to hang on to the ball, which he did. could be an interesting avenue an authoritative challenge and Irvin on the ball Jackson Irvin Diego Costa Marusic Luis Alberto Can they cut up in the defence with the through ball? And close to goal. Oh, that was a terrific stop in a one-versus-one one situation. Well, high fives all round for the goalkeeper. Absolutely fantastic. They've opted for the short one. The object of the exercise is to keep them out. And the cross is very much on. And Irvin on the ball. Parolo now. Radu with it. And now Sergi Enrich. Parolo. 
Is he going to punish them here? Oh, he's knocking on the door. And it's gone in! And on aggregate here, 4-1 is how it stands. Well, they're finding attacking avenues, and it's Willian here, but what can he do? Making excellent progress with the ball at his feet. Nathan Ake here. Jefferson Lerma. This is Diego Costa. Here is William. The fourth official has indicated there will be a minimum Thunders of clear. of Ariton. Barty. Well, regaining possession for his side cleverly. Parolo now. The ball with Luis Alberto. So the whistle then. It is decision night, second leg of this Europa League round of 32 tie, and the second half is underway. Vilhena, the ball with Luis Alberto. Correa. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. So, a corner here. And a deep court opportunity knocks. That's all they can conjure for now. Well, he's given it away. Luis Alberto. Staunch rear guard action. Lewis Cook. You've certainly got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Lee. Well, if he plays like that in the second half, we're in for a real treat. He's scored, he's direct, creative, and he unnerves defenders. Christoph Kramer. The ball with Luis Alberto. Well, he's almost been hassled out of play here. Substitution time it is. Giving the ball to the opposition that time. He has teammates to play it to. Parolo. He's protecting it effectively. Is it going to be... Terrific reflex action. Yeah, you've just got to come out and spread yourself and hope for the best. And that's a deep corner. Easy save. Carrying a genuine threat here. Come on. Well, let's see, does he mean business? Well, let's see what he has in store for them. Corner coming up. The they decided that now is the time to go to the bench. The Corner kick played over. Outrageously good piece of defending on the line. Now he must favour the cross. Now Correa. And here now is Lewis Cook. And here is Vardy. It is a decent looking attack here. Tremendous block. Now, what can he do here? Whatever it takes to keep them out. Corner kick forthcoming. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Now, can he make this move count? Terrific block there. Marusic. And now Serhi Enrich. Marusic. Lukas Leiva. Lewis Cook. Vardy. Jefferson Lerma. And Mousset with it. It's all about translating threats into goals. Let's see what they can do here. Tony Vilhena with it. Marusic. Options in the centre.
Plenty of running room in the wide position. It's with William. Oh, he's through here. Only the keeper to beat. And it's gone out of play. Goal kick coming up. Substitution for Bournemouth. They will now make use of their substitutes bench. To be replaced by number four, Dan Gosling. Lukas Leiva. Marusic. Vilhena. Marusic. And Caicedo has it. Marusic. And a no-nonsense clearance. Well, it might still work out for them. Crossing possibilities. Not fantastic defending. Let's see if it helps the opposition. Joaquin Correa. Powerful enough, but not precise enough. No, not accurate enough at all. He had other options on as well. And just the one minute left in normal time here. Radu has it. No more football tonight. The final whistle blown by the referee. And they've officially made it through to the next round. Well, Derek, what confidence that will give them. A huge margin to go through into the next round. Played very, very well. That confidence, you can use that.